broadly. Following up from um, some announcements earlier this year, during the department's regular oversight of our execution of presidential drawdown authority for Ukraine, we discovered inconsistencies in equipment valuation for Ukraine. In a significant number of cases, services used replacement costs rather than net book value, thereby overestimating the value of the equipment drawn down from U.S. stocks and provided to Ukraine. Once we discovered this misvaluation, the comptroller reissued guidance on March 31st, clarifying how to value equipment in line with the financial management regulation and DOD policy to ensure we use the most accurate of accounting methods. We have confirmed that for FY23, the final calculation is $3.6 billion, and for FY22, it is $2.6 billion for a combined total of $6.2 billion. These valuation errors in no way limit or restricted the size of any of our PDAs or impacted the provision of support to Ukraine. And while the DOD, while the DOD retains the authority to utilize the recaptured PDA, this has no bearing on appropriated USAI or Ukraine PDA replenishment funding approved by Congress.